So here you can see that I have a document opened inside of Adobe in copy and here I have a sentence written out word and uh, my TutorTube logo right here. So you might notice that the logo is not of high quality but it's jagged. So this is something that you can change by going into view and over here you can see that there's an option called display performance. And by default, it is set to typical display because usually in InCopy or InDesign, you don't edit graphics, but you just place it. So when you export it out, it is exported it, uh, it, it exports it in high quality, but while you're editing it, it's a bit lower in quality so that the workflow is faster. But however, if you want to see a high quality preview, you can just set it to high quality. And what happens is that now it is quite clear as you can see, just like this. So this is how you can increase the quality of the pictures because the lower quality picture, it is quite normal. So usually it is suggested to work in typical display so that it does not take up much resources while you're working with in copy documents or even in design documents for that matter. But if you have a lot of pictures and then your document is slowing down while you're working with it, then you might want to enable fast display. What that does is that the picture is still there, but it displays it only as a wireframe. That means the picture is not being processed out and that is why it is faster uh, to work with as well. So I'm just going to go around and set it to typical display itself. So over here, there are some other views as well. So there's screen mode. So by default, this is set to screen mode. That is, you see the outlines of the pictures. As you can see, you see the outline of the document. But if you want to get a preview of how it would look like when you export or print out the document, you can simply go on into view and then you can go on into screen mode and then go on into preview. So what this does is that now you're in preview mode. You can still edit this out as you can see right here, but all of those outlines and everything else disappears. Uh, and this gives a view of how it would look uh, like when you print out the document or export it out. So I'm just going to change it back to normal again. So now uh, there are some fitting options in the view menu as well. For example, you can zoom in right here. You can zoom out. You can fit the page to the entire window or fit uh, spreads, multiple spreads onto the same window as well. If you have that, you can also go to actual size uh, and th that displays it pixel wise on uh, regarding with your monitor settings. And then you can also go around here and uh, and then go around to entire place board. So that really zooms it out as well. And these are the options which are provided uh, for you to work with, with the layout settings and the quality inside of an in copy document. So hope you guys learned something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share and subscribe.